I got a fame. How do you like that strat? He can't touch you. Oh! Oh! Let's go! Where were you when the greatest the Fortnite game of all time came to pass? Where were you? Pro hopefully watching it on YouTube. <laughs> Hello, welcome to the uh, Northern Lion Live Super Sunday subscriber stream. I, as always, am your host, Northern Lion, with my new shelf. That Caden and I built yesterday. It's true. You can look at the games. You got the, the super version of Secret Hitler. There we go. Machi Coral. I believe that's uh, Machi Coral Legacy. Evolution Legacy. Evolution Climate. That's what it's called. You got a. Smile Slime Dice Bag, Sushi Go. I honestly don't know what's on top of that. It's some Final Fantasy game. You got... It's hard to do this mirrored. You got Splendor, King of Tokyo, Catan, miscellaneous games here. Can you see? There's a little Pandemic Legacy below that too. Actually, there's more. There's more below that, but anyway... Suffice it to say, welcome to the Northern Lion Live Super Sunday subscriber stream. Hope you enjoyed the Fortnite video yesterday. It's the greatest video I've ever posted. Um, many people thought when I tweeted, by the way, I tweeted like, man, YouTube is ruthless when you uh, put out a stinker. That was not about Fortnite. That was about the game known as Basketball Classics. Let me check on the analytics there. Your video got 40% fewer views than usual in its first 28 hours. But that's not that ruthless. Before, it was like... Uh, <laughs> it, it was like, your video has 40% uh, fewer uh, views than usual. We're showing it to less people and they watch less often. I was like, God, that's just... It's ruthless, dude. Couldn't you just say like, hey, you can't win them all. Instead, they were like, hey, not only is nobody seeing this, the people that do see it don't like it. Oh, well, I'm just joking. What about when you put out an Isaac episode where you die three times? Uh, that episode got, let's, let's check out the analytics on that. Plus one subscriber. And honestly, it's on the high side of average. Can't complain. It, it, that episode has been watched for 10.4 thousand hours. It's removed another master from the ecosystem. I do love... So people have been... We'll start playing Life is Strange in just a moment here. But people... Uh, they're talking about like stream labs when they or stream elements when they send you uh, like your report when your stream is done. It is great. Sometimes like, hey, this stream, this stream was good. December 16th, 752% increase in subs. And then they give me the peace sign emoji. However, I guess Thursday's stream did not go that well. Because it says, Northern Lion, here's your stream report. Keep at it. You're doing great. If they don't give you specific data, you know you, you fucked up a stream. Northern Lion, good stream. Keep on grinding. <laughs> and I, ha I have a lot of, well, I have a lot of good ones in here, but I also have a lot of keep on grindings. I'm willing to admit. It's when they, when they couldn't find a, a stat to, to pump your tires on. They're like, hey, keep it up. You're doing great. 
Anyway, let's load up Life is Strange 2 here. It does say we're... Hey, you didn't update my stream data. The Northern Line Live Super Sunday Subscriber Stream. Life is Strange 2. Got it. When you try your best and you don't succeed. Well, before we do that, let's see. Has anything new come out? Because the reason we play basketball classics is A, I like sports games, but B, I was like, yo, hasn't been a whole lot of new releases lately thanks to the Steam sale and the time of year that it is. We're, we're, I wouldn't say we're scraping the bottom of the barrel, but we're getting deeper into the barrel than normal. You know, it's like when you're eating nachos, but, you know, you've already eaten all the fully loaded nachos. So mostly, like, you're getting just chips. Like, mostly just chips. That's where we're at right now. We're at just chips. That's against the rules? <laughs> oh, weird. But okay, I guess like if they have a rule, thank you. Yeah, it doesn't look like a whole lot came out today, to be honest. Hold on. Dude, you wouldn't believe how many um, anime games come out on a daily basis. Maybe you would, but like... Like, I'm looking at it just today. Shoot Them 18 appears to be a game. It's a horrible looking first person shooter where you shoot anime waifus. Hente Like a Boss 2. MMD Girls VR underscore DLC 4.0. Pixel Happy Game Girls Deluxe Pack. Flight Angel Special Edition. Yuki Ona. Suzunan on Fire. Like, this is within the past 24 hours. There's been like nine anime girl video games. Shine's Adventure 3. Eternal Destiny's The World of Possibility. Balder Sky. Okay, I don't know. That one actually... It is anime plus mecha, but I'm willing to give that one the benefit of the doubt. And don't even get me started on some of this shit, dude. Santa's Big Sack. Not touching that one with a 10-foot pole. Pink Girl. Adult Only Park. Volume 002. I'm not messing with you. These are since December 20th. It just doesn't end. Like I wouldn't I wouldn't be Chrono Arc. Mysteria Occult Shadows Black Silk Sleepwear. Mysteria Occult Shadows White Maid. Mysteria Occult Shadows Magical Charm. Happy Together Rosebud. I gotta know more. This content requires the base game, Happy Together. This newly moved girl, Ruaxia Shen, looks exactly the same as Chihiro Miniyama, but they have nothing to do with each other. This is incredible. That's what happens when you, you don't have enough money to pay a second model, I guess. She is capable, arrogant, and cold, but really unable to approach her? Will our tenderness and care touch Ruaxia Shen? They look exactly the same, but they have completely different personalities. Can you read reviews of it? Okay, fine. All the lonely people, where do they all belong? It has one user review, but it's not in my language, so I can't read it. All right, let's. What about the base game? Ah! Reviews, mostly positive, 71%. Okay, this is a negative review. No English reviews? Hmm. Well, this is a single Flash video in foreign language UI with about $10 million worth of in-app purchases, along with day one DLC that costs more than the game. Let's check the description. 1,200 more than full HD, full HD videos. It's very important. I say three times. That's an outright lie. 
One video is stored locally and a couple of 10 second clips stream online from God knows where. In addition to video, there are more than 100 photos. F potatoes or photos, another lie. You have to pay for them. Dress up your girlfriends. Dress up your girlfriends with the outfits of your choice and develop the relationships to your lightning. Well, there's only a single, rela single outfit available. You have to buy the rest. Almost nothing is unlockable from gameplay. What a freaking ripoff. Always online. Needs to download stuff. Some parts are not even in English. It's so cute. I don't usually play many games, but this game give me a new experience. Very suitable game after falling out of love. Because you won't worry about losing someone again. Why in the world is this tagged with nudity and sexual content? Not a single exposed nipple. Not a single P in a V. Does nudity and sexual content mean something different in China? Cute game nonetheless, but those tags are very misleading. And for that, thumbs down. It might be the funniest review I've ever seen on Steam. Not a single P in a V. Hold on, I gotta go with more here. Just give it a second. Some of the reviews are honestly just like... This, this review just says, nice girl. How about this one? 20.4 hours on record. So big, I really want to know her name. This one just says Smooey. How about this one? Of course, I'm 007. Where there are beautiful women, there is 007. I'm so happy. This is, this is a scary side of Steam, dude. I don't want to be here. Anyway, so suffice it to say, hey, get out of there. Suffice it to say, that's basically been my experience looking for stuff for Northern Lion Tries over the past seven days or something. Um, let's load Life is Strange too. So if you're ever wondering why... Why, something like Basketball Classics, you're like, oh, it might be, like, it seems a little bit out of your wheelhouse, NL. Yeah, it's because they're not putting out anything in my wheelhouse this month. It's just nonstop games uh, where, like, the art is like an anime girl, and then when you look at the game, it looks like Tomo Quest. It's like they put, like, $1,000 into the, the art for the marketing, and then, like, the game itself was made in 24 hours. Don't get any ideas, chat. It's just a protein shake. <clears throat> Have you tried Steam Labs Recommender? I have indeed. Uh, and it's actually been really good. That's, that's how Demon Crawl got recommended to me. Um, that's how, uh, Meteor Fall Crewman's Tale got recommended to me. That's how Balancelot got recommended to me. Um, I do, I, I think that the Steam Labs recommender is actually really good. More balance a lot? Maybe. He would rather listen to the Steam Labs recommender than listen to Twitter? Absolutely, I already know on Twitter. I'm not gonna play Doki Doki Literature Club, okay? Just do it and be a legend. I might play My Summer Car.
Well, anyway. Life is strange, uh, too. Once upon a time. Kind of gone off the rails a little bit recently. Um, there were two wolf brothers. I'm genuinely hopeful there. that it can bring oh. it back. They lived in peace until hunters took their dad away. But I don't know. And they had to go. On Please the skip the wolf intro. Absolutely not. I feel like this wouldn't be so bad if you played the episodes as they came out. But playing them one after another is like... You are like, I get it, they're wolves! I've seen this part. Where they could train day and night. They were happy. But the little wolf got very sick. Do you think this game is good, NL? Ask me after this episode. The brothers made it to the home of their ancestors. Um, but for now, I definitely do think it's like a pretty major step down from episode or Life is Strange one. The brothers had nowhere to stay again. This is the worst reviewed episode. They soon entered the old forest of the giants, where they met a pack of stray dogs. I've also realized, like. Because I've seen a lot of Life is Strange 2 discourse online. I've realized the kind of people who like this game and the kind of person that I am are like... We're not... We don't overlap in the same demos for the most part. Which is fine. But like, I saw somebody in like a year-end thread on our games was like... I really hated episode 3 because I hated all of the characters on the weed farm. And I was like, that's my dude. And then there were like 10 comments underneath that that were like, you just don't get it if this is society's most marginalized people that have been pushed to this and this is what capitalism has uh, caused these people to do just in order to survive. And I was like, okay, yeah, it's, I get it now. Suddenly, the main farmers who owned the land try to hurt the brothers. The little cub was injured. He transformed into a super... But there were some people that were like, uh... And destroyed yeah, but I don't get it. Like, why didn't Daniel just wait outside for literally 30 seconds? Like, the, the fact that they didn't give you any choice on that is crazy. And then even the people who were in love with the game were like, yeah, okay, that makes was. sense. But when I was nine, I also had poor impulse control and blah, blah, blah. I'm like, okay. Yeah, all right. Anyway, so... um. It's all right. We'll have some fun here together. If this game was a movie, how do you think it would be reviewed? I think it would be received a lot like the butterfly effect, which is um, people with even a seed of cynicism like myself would, would find it mockable. People that went in with 100% sincerity would think it's like one of the deepest movies ever made. So put it in there with uh, the butterfly effect and the number 23 and... Uh, Darren Aronofsky's hey, The Fountain. I'm sorry. That last one's gonna rankle some people. I didn't mean to. It was a bad idea. Sucker Daniel. Punch. No way. It's all good. This is this is a flashback. I wish we didn't go along with Finn, even though I wanted to. <sighs> this it's isn't okay, a flashback? Dude. You're my brother. This must be a flashback. Or a dream. So, why don't you come and get me? Okay. Noted. I'm alone, Sean. I don't know what to do. I'm scared. Use your mind don't powers so to rustle up some breakfast. Please, come and get me. Yes, I, I swear. <sighs> Stop! When video games claim to have a bald hairstyle. 
This is what they mean. A hospital in Northern California. So now he's broke on top of being orphaned. Way to go, Sean. Fuck. Daniel. This must be my punishment. <laughs> no, the punishment is when you can't pay for the lunch, so they kick you out of the hospital. Yeah. Thanks for the card, Agent. Can't wait to text you. Wow. Cantieno. Thank you. Can't catch shit. Zero depth perception. Goodbye, sports. <laughs> I think uh, that that train had probably sailed in advance of this. I'm glad the cops didn't mess with them, too. I really hope they could keep going. Yeah, whatever. Um... Glad Steven's leg is better. Yo, it's the grandfather. Tough We're grateful to find out you're safe and awake, blah, blah, blah. Find Daniel, blah, blah, blah. This must be hard for you. So glad Chris is okay. Yo, Chris lived! That kid is a real superhero on his own. Captain Spirit is alive! I am fine. I miss both of you a lot. After my accident, I had to wear a stupid cast forever. I was trapped in my room all winter. Sucks! <laughs> all right, call, call Joey. Yay. Stupid reality shows. You shut the fuck up. In today's work-a-day world full of strife and mel melancholy, any kind of escape you can get, you take it. This day feels like... Oh, I can't even focus on the page. Was in a coma for weeks, blind and fucked. Plus in police custody, going to jail soon. Hospitals freak me out. Hate this. Where's Daniel? I'm scared. 90 day does not suck. You guys are cowards. Afternoon checkup. Sure. <laughs> Good day, sunshine. Hey, Joey. Hey, man. If they called it Boku no 90 Day Fiance, you guys would be it losing like your it shit. Might have been food. Hard to tell. Ha ha. Never heard that before. Oh, somebody is in a bad mood. Sorry, Joey. Not feeling it today. Mm, I don't blame you. But maybe I got something to cheer you up. Pecans and chocolate? Uh oh. I honestly thought There's that was that a cigar. Smile. Thanks, Joey. So, how you feeling today? Any headaches? Socket pain? No. It's all good. Well, this is your final test before... Mm, you know. Before they... Check you out. Check me out to Julie. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, let's see. You know the drill. Don't blink and just stare at the light. This is nice, where they have some music, nice probably. Response. Okay. Now, try to follow the light as well as you can. I was going to say the same thing. This man, he has an incredible haircut. The Come edge on, work son. is out of control. You've been there before. Good, good. I feel like a, a cat Keep right going. now. Quick response. Nice. Remember, to see objects on your left side, you got to turn your head more now. Yes. Looking good, Sean. Now try to align your pen with mine. I'll try. No rush. This is tough. Not really. Your depth perception oh, will always <laughs> never be mind. affected. So you got to try harder. Oh, shit. Yeah, I know. It's hard. Oh, come on. <laughs> Yeah, that's enough. That's an impossible task. 
But remember, your depth perception will always be... It is me playing a battle royale. Mm. Here, read this. Yep. Patient cleared. Patient cleared. Send him right to jail. Do not pass go. Do not collect two hundred dollars. I always. Man, what do you think this is? Scandinavia. You can try, but you can't rig the exam, Sean. <sighs> this time we release you. Sorry, your vision has improved a lot. Mm. Now you don't really have. Uh, Joey, can I have the check, anymore. please? Yeah. That's just great. I do have to tell them the truth, but first, let's clean this dress. Hey. Sure hope you're watching the door like your phone. Oh, come on. He <sighs> ain't going nowhere. Great. All I do is watch him. Yes, true. Your job. <laughs> do you mind if we talk alone? Mind if I finish with my patient? He looks good for now, right? Just... Oh, I'm sorry, doctor. With him. I didn't recognize you because you were wearing the, sure. a cop's badge. I'll swing by later, Sean. So this is where we hate her because she's a cop. But then later, she does like an action that's unexpected, perhaps to reunite us with Daniel. And as a result, we recognize, hey, man, life is strange. People are nuanced. So how are you feeling today, Mr. Diaz? Amazing. Did you find Daniel? I want to go over this again. What? I've been telling the same fucking story for three weeks. How much longer? He said the Until F word to a sense. cop. Until you get it right. So, silence isn't gonna help you now. Listen close, Sean. Yo, this is a forced Tomorrow confession. Tomorrow going to Jolina Shore and you'll be arraigned in court for the murder of a Seattle police officer. You might spend the rest of your life in prison or you can talk to me. I'm innocent until proven guilty. Yeah. Right? And I believe that. That's why I want you to tell me the whole truth. We don't it's need to get like all those like attorneys involved, involved and stuff like that. that like we're cool. Talk? No, no way. And you're absolutely sure your dad didn't go after the officer. Are you shitting me? That officer freaked out and shot him in front of me and Daniel. Just guilty of being who knows. I hear you, but you sure you didn't get upset and go after the officer? It happens. Jesus, no. Look at me. Okay, let's just jump ahead. Tell me what happened in that farm in Humboldt. The place looks like a tornado wiped it out. I've told you so many times. I have no clue why the place was trashed. I passed out. Did you check Plus the security two cam? Seriously wounded, <laughs> along with you, and a missing child. The only statement we have is yours, Sean. Throw me a bone here. Can't you see I want to help? So you haven't found my brother. We might have some leads. You can help by telling me the truth. <sighs> Okay. God, just make oh. up a confession already so she leaves. The robbery. Whose idea was it? His? That is Takashi 69. Huh? Well, it was his idea, to be honest. But I did go along with it. So, solidarity. We all did. Meryl totally ripped us off. Not a good guy. That's what happens when you mess with drug traffickers. Daniel wanted to leave, but he's just a kid. And I didn't listen. Why didn't you try to get help? Go to the police. Oh, yeah. The police would help me. After they shot my dad and accused us of murder. Great plan. Idiot. So Finn wanted to get revenge on Meryl, too. Your friend is learning the hard way. Don't lecture me, okay? I did exactly what I had to do to take care of my family. After what you had to go through, I get it. 
but that doesn't change the situation or let you off the hook. Thank you for your statement, Sean. It's really helping. By the way, we contacted your grandparents in Beaver Creek. His leg is fucked. They can visit you after you're transferred. Might be a while, but you do have a support group. That Ikea mom just fell right on his tibia. Good. What about Daniel? You said you had leads. I said might. Got him! Uh, hold on. <laughs> Tricked you, dumbass. Didn't anyone, anyone ever tell you not to talk to a cop without a lawyer, dummy? Is he back in jail now? At least Cassidy wasn't at Merrill's when it blew up. I wonder what Merrill told the cops about the rock. Sorry, Hannah. <laughs> Hope the cops didn't mess with Penny. Prison would fuck. Remember them? Up. Yes. <laughs> it's not a big deal. You had too big a dresser, too small a screw, and now your leg is absolutely fucked. You should know. Your grandma kissed me on the cheek on my way in. I told you I was going to be away for a while. I'm sorry, okay? We gotta be good. Okay. When Ella will you find the phone? Let me out, please. Yes. Love you. Hola, mama. I've already looked at the photos. I, I don't want to be reminded of, of these characters anymore. Life sure is strange. <laughs> Would this game have been received better if it were a Netflix show? Sorry about that. It's a good question, but I'm gonna say no. Okay. I feel like Bandersnatch so also Daniel? was not you that really well received. Leads? Yes. And they haven't do. done it since. That's our job. The bureau put his profile out over four states. So we are on the case. You lied to me. You have no leads. You have no fucking idea where my brother is. I don't lie, Sean. But you did. And your brother is paying the price. Wow. Fuck. You. I'm done. Anyway. Thanks for talking to me. Loser. I'll be back tomorrow to take you to the next shore. <laughs> Those pants with that jacket? Ooh. <laughs> she might be a real cop, but she's a fashion criminal. <sighs> ah, ah, ah. I know how to recognize these. This is... YouTube audio library. Attribution not required. Mood sad. Duration 130 to 2 minutes. How about sad hip hop and rap? Yiddish sadness. Here we go. Uh sinking ship. That sounds perfect. Thanks a lot, Joey. Ah, uh, now. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. Sit down so we can get this show going. So, how did your interview with Scully go? She's really named Scully, huh? You mean interrogation? Who knows? Maybe Detective Flores wants to help. Ah, he's making an X-Files joke. Just can't trust Her name is After Flores. What you and your brother went through. I don't blame you. The problem oh, is when I make a joke, wrong, I try you to make it like funny or now. at least amusing. Every day. I so I think guess person. that's where the confusion lied. Thanks, Joey. Want to tell that to the judges? I'm just saying, you don't deserve this. 
Now let's check this out. Oh God, he's taking the other eye. The healing is coming along nice. Just got to keep it clean for the next week or so. Simple. That's great. Seen the shrink this morning? What did she say? Nothing I want to hear. This will take time and rehab, Sean. You have to process first. Ugh. I can tell myself that shit. Clearly, I'm no therapist, but I've nursed patients with your injury. They all turned their oh, really? into Oh, You've energy. nursed other patients who lost their eye due to a psychic <laughs> blast of energy the from their little brother? It's pretty cool now. <laughs> Things change, huh? I hear you. I'm trying to be positive. But it's so hard. I know. I do. But I promise there's a treat coming your way. <laughs> now as for your wound, this is the last time you hear this from me. You have to clean it with sterile gauze and saline solution. Hope the area using the swab and I'm paying attention. We're gonna have to do this later. Otherwise, our eye will get infected. We're gonna end up looking like that guy from Donnie Darko. Dressing. And you're the shit. Remember, you gotta do this. Four times a day. Four times a day? It must be I'm nice to not have a job. job. Wish I could have done more. Dude, you saved my ass here. You're the only one I trust. It really helped. Cool. I'm glad when I can make a ch Oh, shit. Ah, emergency. <laughs> I'm out. And no smoke break. Let's say our goodbye tomorrow. Oh, Sean, check out that towel. Got your name all over it. <sighs> Catch you later. Joey, you are her boss. <laughs> what? Wow. Haven't seen you in a long time. <laughs> it's a fully loaded 9mm Beretta wrapped up in the thread count. And a note that says, don't trust anyone. I know I fucked Daniel over. Again. And now he's gone. Where would he hide out? A ten-year-old by himself? Out there? He might go back to Seattle. But too far. Nowhere to go. If he tried to hook up with Claire and Steven, they would have definitely told me. Or the cops. <laughs> Damn Superman all by himself. Sure hope he's okay. Wait. What's that? Superwolf. Does that mean? It means that Daniel. Daniel's with Jacob somewhere. He's safe. I could see him again. Huh. Who? Jacob is the r slash atheism mod from the last episode. Had a few beers. Daniel's asleep. He wants to train more, but we don't have time. Sean, I borrowed a blanket and a few other things from your tent. We'll give them back to you when you come looking for your Super Wolf comic. It's waiting for you, Jake. Agent 420, give me hot dogs. Me? Two-story house shit. Akaranyo. Ah, I get it. It's freaking me out. I see. It's like Akira, but Daniel. I get it.
74 pages? Are you insane? Nevada. Oh, hell yeah. Met the new workers from Europe, Anders and Ingrid. Cute couple. Makes me want to travel overseas someday. This dude has no idea. Oh, you you can't do anything on an airplane. You can't you definitely can't take a psychic 10-year-old. I gotta get to him. I gotta find a way to escape. Tonight. Yo, is that a Ford Raptor? It's a Lamborghini Mustang. Oh, it, music time? Probably music time. Okay. This whole hospital is crying. So don't make any noise. <laughs> okay, well, you heard the man. I do, I gotta know what sad rap is like. How about... First, 80s video game death. Yo, it's, it's like a Stranger Things bop. Things are going Southampton. Sad hip-hop and rap. Oh, I know sad rap. It's like future, but times negative one. So soulful. All right. Find a way to get the hell out of here. Wish I could just walk out. They lock you in? They probably lock you in. They've been working on these rooms forever. Oh, so far, my backpack has got to be somewhere around here. I spent half of the runtime of this whole game just looking for my backpack. Oh, excuse me. Check the grab bar. This one isn't screwed in. <laughs> oh, that's like horrible. I could pull it off. That's a that's a lawsuit waiting to it's happen. Be loud. Uh. Ryan, what's your favorite album of the year? Um, Songs from the Big Chair by Tears for Fears. No. That's what that's up there for sure. Joey's the only one who helped me get through this shit. Obviously, pick it up. Actually, the best album of the year, though. Is type in to Google Play Music Hall and Oates Rich Girl Maybe and I then hit the three dot menu the and hit start radio. Bed. Album of the year. Rich Girl, Brandy, open parentheses, you're a fine <sighs> girl. Crocodile Rock by Eldon John. Ricky, don't lose that number. Bed sheets. Hope my last view of this world isn't this window. One stupid car. Nope. And I'm out of here. Wrong again. It's dead tonight. Works for me. Ah, we go to the construction room and take the scaffolding down. Yo, that's true. Actually, my album of the year is definitely Close to the Edge by Yes. Can I have some privacy, please?
Make fake body. <laughs> Idiot's got his shirt on backwards. <laughs> what a dumbass. That looks so fake. Who does he think he is? Crisscross? But it might work for a second. Okay, so hear me out here. I think we grab the bar, use the call button, and then when somebody comes in to look at the fake body, a way to leave this room without we hit him over the head and then run. I, th I think it's the only way, dude. Okay, so step one. You tear the bar off the wall. Let's do it. Hey, what the hell are you doing in there? It wasn't very loud. I agree. Nice job, Sean. What do you mean? What's the problem, dude? Now the guard is awake and pissed off. Yeah, and then the next step is you hit the call button. <laughs> Wait, what did that say? Ambush guard. Joey could probably distract the guard dog. Hey, hello? I need help. Please. What? What's the matter, kid? Huh? My head. It's killing me. I need help. Hold on. Uh, you're gonna need help if you're fucking with me. Oh. <laughs> I told you it was gonna work, dude. I did not kill him. I just gave him temporary brain damage. CTE. Yeah, exactly. He's okay, Inyanyo. That's not how you pronounce that. What is he doing here? Uh, escape. <laughs> the hard cut, like they didn't expect anybody to just ignore him, was so good. <laughs> they did not test this game on 31 year olds. It's a 1998 Dodge Intrepid. Can you drive with one eye? So for real, my uh, my grandpa, when he was like 20, apparently, tripped and hit. The, the, you're not gonna love this story. He hit his eyeball on the corner of like a bleacher and lost sight in his eye for the rest of his life. Still drove me around all the time. 
He was he was an adequate driver. Very very bad way to lose your you know depth perception, but. It's this Halloween, Halloween music. This is actually the main menu music for a, a $3 indie game. Oh! So there was already music in the background. <laughs> what if he stole Joey's car? <laughs> oh. <laughs> that is great. Yo, this is, uh, do make say think 100%, aka Canadian explosions in the sky. Welcome to Nevada. The Pacific, let's go, that's my time zone. Visiting Bear Taffy. The end. How many electoral college votes does this state get? The whole time he's been here, I have not seen one other human being. And, of course, that's great timing. Another car just drove by, but they're probably a tourist. <sighs> Yo, dude, if you lost an eye... Could you smoke through your eye socket? Like if you created a perfect seal and <laughs> breathed in, could you? Or could you could you this smoke the and then let the smoke out through your eye socket? Fuck. My I'm eyes not even shaped. supposed to be here. I will never hold until Haven Point. Guess I'm kind of lucky I stole a smoker's car. Owner's stuff. I she gotta know. Nice. Shit. Guess I fucked up her day pretty bad. <laughs> I'm not even supposed to be here. <laughs> Oh, 
Okay. Haven Point is straight ahead. Just a few more hours drive. Don't forget about the Power Bear toy. I'm still waiting where, when we can leverage that. Yes, clean eye, please. All right. Careful. Can't you just put like a grape in there and then roll with it? Man, I should have listened to Joey. This is a mess. I don't even know how long I should keep on using this for. I think you'll probably know. Um. What a mess. Flotus can now add Grand Theft Auto to my file. All right. Oh, come on. Did you interview everyone in that hospital? Or what? Oh, get some sleep. Honestly, probably a sensible idea. Plus, I don't think there's any other options. You're not supposed to turn on that light anyway. That's like the ultimate make father angry button. You ever hit that shit while he's driving? It's like the air raid siren goes off. So what are you trying to do? Get us killed? You hit that button on the highway, it's like you covered his eyes. You'd think that the button is it makes the car explode. More music, huh? Still with me, Sean? <laughs> yeah. Just zoning out. Just what was in that saline? That when you're driving, my son. So, uh, what's the verdict on the new car? I know it's not a new board, but it's got four hot wheels. Thanks for finishing it, Dad. A perfect reward for your excellent report card. <laughs> I'm proud, Sean. I usually got like like a trip to that Red Lobster if I got a good report card. Cash. And I'll try to be cool. No dad jokes, huh? I'm not complaining, by the way. It was a pretty good dinner. But I didn't get a car. What did you order? <laughs> Broiled Fisherman's Feast. Thanks. Little bit, of, little bit of lobster, little bit of shrimp, little bit oh, of fish. Thanks for your patience. Couple of scallops, Mr. Millennial. Think we can hang out for five days without killing each other? Hell yeah. Haven't done that since I was a kid. Miss it. So do I. Been too long since we went padre hijo against the road. <laughs> Way too long. I love road trips. You'll get over it. Good Try flying. <laughs> By the way, boy, Tom, you watch like two movies and you're there. What's going on with that gin, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't really want to talk about it now. If that's cool. That was like pulling teeth. Well, I've got a week to find out the truth. What? It's okay. Don't worry about it. Not much to say. Okay, okay. Keep your secrets to yourself. <laughs> Keep your secrets I then. Pry. Ah. Could that be Daniel? Hola. Hello. Everything okay, Lila? Oh, Daniel better not be giving you any sass. To the swing pool, and now we're making popcorn for movie night. 
Yeah, all right. Why don't you just call me uh, when you uh, do other mundane stuff? He's driving real slow and safe. Uh, now I'm uh, rinsing off some vegetables. Ring, 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 ring. Oh, I'm tying my shoes. <laughs> you know, I was trying to remember because the idea of driving with your ghost dad. Yeah. I know. See, I had seen it in other media oh, before, really? and I just remembered it's Life is Strange 1. Chloe has a dream where she drives with her ghost dad. Maybe like four times? Maybe it's before the storm, actually, now that I think about it. It's too bit, but I miss you. I miss you too, my son. But this is all part of growing up. I know. Dad getting shot by the police? I don't like Psychic little brother? I have total faith in you, Sean. Killing that cop so you could You're break out BS. of the for-profit hospital? We were born to roam. Just, just signposts on the road of life. I love you, Dad. Wish I would have told you more. You didn't have to tell me. You showed me. Boom. By the way, oh. hey, wake up. Huh? huh? What? Yeah, what the fuck are you doing on our oh, property? Oh, no. Huh? Oh, man, I crashed hard. Oh, yeah? Come on out, boy. Who the fuck is that? A fucking kid. Get out. I'm leaving. Look. I'm not even supposed to be I'm here. You ain't. Step out or I'll call the cops. You don't want that boy. Whatever, dude. I'm leaving. No need to. I I'm leaving. Now. You deaf? I said out. All right. I guess I will not be choosing my own fate. Assholes like you anyway. Listen, I don't want any trouble. Too late for that, boy. So tell us what the fuck you're doing on our land. Your land? I drove for so long, I I had to pull over to get some rest, you know? I swear, I had no idea this was your property. There's a fucking sign. Didn't you see it? <laughs> I've... Was I'm just gonna exhausted. go ahead and say it. I guess I If you're it. in Life is Strange too, it's and you meet a kid, white guy kid, wearing overalls, yeah? get what ready for some QTEs. I got into an accident. Oh yeah? Uh-huh. Move it. <sighs> you still got that grab bar? Please. I just want to go. Ho oh, ho. What's this? Drugs? Yeah. <laughs> for my eye. Oh yeah. Did you steal them? Like this car? Listen, it's not what you think. Oh, I think it is. You ain't the first beaner we caught. Take his backpack. Dude, come on. Get it. Let's see what he's holding. I'd be lying if I thought there was anything less than a 100% chance that was going to happen. So? Nothing good. Just a bunch of... Is this a power bear figure? <laughs> Do you still play with toys? I knew it. it belongs to my brother. Leave it alone. I spent my life savings on that thing. Oh, I'm taking it back, dude. Whoa, you did not. That's it, boy. Get up. Up. Okay, Chad. We fucked with him. Let him go. He's got nothing. Hey. Hold on a sec, Mike. You speak Spanish, Pedro? Huh? What? 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 Hablas Espanol. Oh, cool, because I teach a class down professor. at the community center. How do you say, I'm a dirty thief? If you're interested, here's a flyer. Soy un... Sucio ladrón. Soy un sucio ladrón. 
Nice. Sounds better when you say it. <laughs> this is fun. Then when he gets now, close, say, uh, blast him. I'm a dirty thief with one eye. <laughs> <laughs> Soy un ladrón y chinga tu madre. Uh, wait, madre? Uh, what did you really say, asshole? Huh? All I want to do is learn Espanol. <laughs> Might be our official language someday, right? See, si, senor? So, one more lesson. How do you say... This is not my country. Fuck off. This is my country. <laughs> Did you hear that? Look, Chad, it's gonna <laughs> rain. Let's go before we get soaked. No, we took the country back. I, I can't believe this what's happening right now. You're really pissing me off, you know that? But I'm willing to give you one last chance to make things right. Chad, it's raining! Sing something. What? Just pass the audition, and you're free. We'll be very upset if you refuse. I kind of want to sing, to be honest. You didn't have to sing like in this broken voice like this. You could have sang something defiant. You didn't have to sing Twinkle Twinkle Little Star with the with the broken soul. Jeez, enough. Let the boy finish his song. Go on. Go on. <laughs> He's still going. Sour, please. He's still going. Me pregunto que serás. Well, damn! I think you just won Mexican Idol. <laughs> now pick up all it's your. It's called the Voice the Mexico, out. you scumbag. Don't ever come back. Understand? All right, lads, get her done. See you later. Yeah, just just sideswipe them. Fuck! Fuck! That was really bad. So the... The Wolf Brothers were split apart. The oldest wolf was badly hurt. But nothing could stop the wolf from following his brother's tracks. <laughs> Hell yeah, bro. The MF and pack has your back. Yo, he's got the hype beast lacing, though. It's the Winter Soldier shirt. I forgot about that.
Okay. Still a few hours away from Haven Point. Almost Take the road. There. You get a move speed bonus. Two pair casino. 22 miles ahead. Shit, I need a break. Might be some shade at the next billboard. You know what's wild? You know, we go to Washington Stop. now and then. Can't run for miles. It's like street. as soon as you cross the border, this is what you see in your sight line forever. Is just ads for casinos as far as the eye can see. And then also huge billboards that are like, Cush Canyon, come by legal weed. Poker, blackjack, spaghetti. <laughs> yes. Shade. Oh, man. My feet are killing I've me. I've never played spaghetti. Feels like hiking in hell. Yes, drink water, please. <sighs> Shit. My throat feels like sand. What are you doing here, boy? <laughs> what are you doing on my billboard? <laughs> All right, I need you to do something ridiculous. Like, could you do like, like 50 push-ups or something while I laugh at you? Never drew a desert before. Huh. It's so empty and quiet. <sighs> okay. Just draw now. Don't think about anything else. Can you sing, you can go your own way, but as K.K. Slider? Well, it, it, it has the sound A in it, right? So it's too easy, right? It's just like... Kiko, Kiko, Kokwe. Kiko, Kokwe. It's just that easy. I'm with you. The, we've met way too many people who are openly, uh, brazenly racist. Like, the situation that so we're empty. seeing huh. is what happens in real life. Except in real life, this situation does not come to pass. It's I just what the racist it. person imagines they did and then posts that they did on Facebook after the fact. Okay. Just draw now. Don't think about anything else. I just need to focus on the subject and get in the zone. Like I used to. Got a good picture of it. I'm ready to draw now. Guess I could spice things up a bit. <laughs> Make the whole thing funnier. Glass half empty. I could try adding details. Focus a bit more. Okay. Just draw now. Don't think about anything else. Man. My eye always starts hurting when I focus for too long. What eye? You mean your socket, brother. Dude, that would be sick if you got a, a solar panel in the socket. Or, dude, what if you put like a little, like a derringer in it? So the next time he gets harassed, he just goes, Didn't hey, check this out. 
pop someone. Feels like I haven't seen him in years. Like Rose oh, McGowan's leg from him. Grindhouse. Even his whining. Yeah, you couldn't wait to get out on your own. Now you are. It sucks. Oh, Claypool 2112. Thank you for the gifted subscriptions. Must have been a good joke. <sighs> Okay, dude, it's been like 30 feet. Like, I get it. It's hot. You gotta at least go billboard to billboard, though. Oh, shit, there's a truck coming. Whoa. Got him. Is he honking at me? He's stopping. Uh, okay, uh, be cool. <laughs> Just see what he wants. Oh, God. Just go by the driver's side first, please. I gotta get a look at him. <laughs> Truckers can't be cops. It's against the right. law. License plate says... Pence, LOL. I think we might be okay. Just old, get ready to run. portly, working if class white free. man. I think we're gonna be okay. Hey, need a lift? Plus, he's got the cactus drawing. It's too damn hot to be walking. I'm getting in. Yeah, thanks. Hold up. Dude, I think this guy's okay. They won't introduce you to two bad encounters in a row. It's against the rules of narrative. <laughs> Wasted. Not, nothing alarming yet. Yo, he's got choco crisps. The American flag is not the worst flag he could have in his truck. There's nothing wrong with that. Jeez. What the hell happened to you? It could be the Canadian flag. I ran into a couple of assholes who beat me up for no reason. Uh, I see. Happens a lot around here. Hey, Anton. You there? Everything all right? European yeah, name? GPS tells me you parked in the I'm telling you. This guy, it's looking up. I know what happened. I, uh... Picked up a hitchhiker. I had to make a shit stop. Ooh, I Over. don't know. That, now I don't like that. Much information, but... <laughs> you mean number two. You owe me a beer for that. Over and out. Don't freak out. I... I wouldn't have picked you up if I cared about that hitchhiking law. Okay. Yeah. Cool. So... You hungry or what? Cooler sandwich. You look hungry. <sighs> I am. Thank you. As you heard, my name's Anton. Mm. It is good, huh? My wife packs the best sandwich. He's married? Everything's yeah. okay. Messy. Best sandwich ever. <laughs> hey, what are you talking about? Seriously. Thanks, sir. Anton. Anton. Right. Don't do this to me. At least it didn't happen during the Forza Eliminator. What's your destination? Hmm. Haven Point. You've heard of it? Oh, yeah. Straight ahead, about an hour.
music time. Can you just reveal your, your character flaw to me right off the bat? Is it uh, stimulant use? Alcoholism? Take a nap if you want. You don't have to stay awake to be nice. Hey, don't worry, kid. I'm not a fucking weirdo. That is exactly a what boring trucker a weirdo would say. I'm not like other truckers. I'm a cool trucker. Do not fall asleep, Sean. I I value my own agency here. Hey, kid, you want to stop for some spaghetti? You think he's just going to drop me off? Last stop. Yeah? All right. Even point. Thank you so much. You just be careful out here. These people are kind of weird. Really? Okay. 10-4, good buddy. All right. No problem. What did I tell you, Chad? I had a good feeling about him. He might jack off as soon as I'm out of eyesight, but... <laughs> you know. While I was in the cab, he didn't try anything. Life is a gamble. Bet on the Lord. I cannot wait to see what kind of hijinks we're going to get into here. Oh my. Hope those people are caring Christians. Like our grandparents. I'm calling it. Nice daughter, jerk father who's just a jerk because his daughter's you sick. okay now? Is it gone? I... I think. Good. Scoot back inside now. Okay, Dad. Uh... Hello there. Is everything... Sorry, uh, church is yeah, closed. Yeah, uh, Don't worry. You here for the service? Uh, yeah, I I am, but it's my first time. Don't be shy. Everybody's welcome here. Okay. No matter who you are or where you're from. Yeah, plus we're not like In fucking eyes, weirdos or whatever. We all equal. Plus, we have a pretty nice spread after the service. Stay as long as you want. Okay, um, thanks. <laughs> Don't thank me. I'm just a vessel for our reverend. Thank her. Looks like you're here to see our new miracle, right? Uh-oh. Uh, <laughs> what miracle? <laughs> you haven't heard of him? Then it's Daniel, him. dude! He'll be here any minute now. Just come in. This is like C-3PO from Return of the Jedi. Praise the Lord. You leave your 10-year-old brother alone for 10 seconds. He already started a new cult. No 1980s video cameras, please. Oh, feel that cold air. Hey, look, it's their impression oh, of a Twitch streamer. Thank God for AC. <laughs> I take care of people. Maybe they need it. And that's my impression of you guys. <laughs> <laughs> uh, anyway, moving on. A society run by greed and technology. Do you think we're any smarter? <laughs> Look at the world. What are you doing? Why do we bow to these machines and ignore the real creator? Why? 
I kind of wanted to hear more, honestly. Don't draw too much attention. Oh, you got to go up in the balcony. Better try upstairs. That's where all the cool kids sit anyway. Faith. We hear that word a lot. But faith is not just a word, my brothers and sisters. Oh, no. What is faith? Remember Luke 18, 27. What is impossible for Oh, she's, she's strutting. Is possible she's back on her bullshit. Once you pull the mic off the stand. Faith comes the salvation of you your know she's soul. about to get to the point. Can you cross it's like a TED talk. Bridge to salvation? Do you want your soul to be saved, brothers and sisters? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I guess so. You are not like all these sinners out there. So I never asked the Lord for a sign. Then he gave me one. He spoke to me and told you think that's me our mom? that I was doing right. And to reward our great faith, the Lord sent me the ultimate gift. An angel. A child graced with the power of God. Yes. The miracle we have all been praying for. Waiting for. Can I get a hallelujah? hallelujah. Do you have faith in his power? Why does she have the same body language that I do when I win a game of Tetris 99? Then please welcome our newest member. And our latest miracle, the angel Daniel. Praise you, angel. Dude, they put him through the Mormonizer. Here is Daniel. What is that haircut, dude? <laughs> they turned you into a into a Lego piece. Saved Daniel so he could do his work. Oh my God! You made him cut his own hair. Brought to me to deliver us, to guide us from the wilderness to our destiny. He looks like that picture of the cat with the watermelon helmet. Power of the Lord. It's Lloyd Christmas. <laughs> Turn it upside down. That'll really mess with them. <laughs> when <laughs> this is when Dan uploads a new a new Tetris episode. Or the YouTube audience when a new Hades video goes live. With your own eyes. Now we have a voice. A messenger. Our flock keeps growing. I see more and more new faces. But this is only the beginning. You must spread the word. Bear witness to this miracle. Thank you so much for coming. And, and top right, by the way. Amen. Praise you, Daniel. As our Reverend said, we do appreciate your kind donations. This helps us keep our church and to spread the word of God. Oh yeah, 
There's only a few tickets left for our picnic raffle next Sunday. Don't miss the child and another miracle. Yeah, this time he's gonna levitate. Uh, he's gonna levitate uh, like a bigger, bigger cross. This time he's gonna do a bigger cross. And really, just increasingly large religious artifacts as time goes on. Your, Daniel should become a street magician. It would be so much more profitable if he did like the Chris Angel shit, but Hi. not fake. Oh, uh, like when he pulled that lady's God. torso Why off of her legs. That parking lot earlier. <laughs> yep, that was me. I like to be here too. We can see the whole room, and it's where a reverend mother teaches us classes. <laughs> oh. You okay? Need some water? Uh, no, sorry. As you can see, the sick. developers have decreed oh, that I am very sorry. sick. Oh, that's At some point, bad. Daniel is going to be forced to heal me, and then we're going to find out that he cannot, and they're going to lose faith and kick us out of this place. As they've kicked us out of every other place we've been to in every single episode or in the series so far. I? Well, that's a long story. That's okay. My name is Sarah Lee. What's yours? Aw, you must be Jacob's sister. Did you get that letter from Jacob back when he was in California? Yes. <coughs> How did you know he was in California? <laughs> Excuse I me, I had uh, bean burritos That's for lunch. How we met. You are Daniel's brother? Really? He's always talking about you. Hey, uh, not too loud. Yes, I'm Daniel's brother, but I need some help. The Reverend Mother says we always have to help our neighbor. What do you need? So, can you take me to Daniel? Oh, yes. He's gonna be so happy when he sees you. He missed you so much for his birthday. What do you think Everything the odds like are that Daniel surprise. just ices us? And is like, I've never seen this guy before in my whole life. Daniel, you're the living proof of their faith. And mine. I know you understand. I guess... I mean... Sean? Alright, zero percent. Oh my. Sean! You came back! I knew it! You've grown up and I know... Do I look older? Well... <laughs> what? What happened to your eye? Don't worry. It's okay. Did that happen at the farm? Because of me? I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. You know what I just figured out? They gave him the K-pop haircut. It's over, Daniel. We just gotta walk on. Does it hurt? No. <laughs> Not as much as your haircut. Shut up. Stan Daniel. It's different. <laughs> I kind of like it. Sean, I didn't want to leave you there. Nothing I could do. Dude. I was so scared. No, I said it, Chad. Stan Daniel. And it's okay. We're together now. Yes. So, are you going to stay with us now? Huh? I... We still need to go to Puerto Lobos. But we don't need to. We have a new home now. Look. One step at a time, Daniel. Give Sean a chance to process Lady, you this. look like you I'm sell sure sweaters all so at like one of those stores in the mall, but the not way, like the normal mall, like the weird mall Richard. in every town. We all prayed for your safe return. Sean, the store is just called like Energies. Now in our and you're like, I've too. never seen anyone inside of there. And you're like, yeah, we sell sweaters and also like Jade. Well, not really. No. So Daniel was wrong? Hmm. You can be honest here, Sean. But first, I need Sarah Lee and Daniel to you grab You look the like you own Hallmark stock. We have to stock. take care of our new guest. This is a place of healing. Aww. Let's do it later. I want to talk to him Daniel, now. Daniel, 
now. Okay, Reverend Mother. Let's go, Daniel. Whoa, whoa. Hold on. Well, sure. Why are you wearing the it's thing that covers the keys on this a piano a when you're not using it? Today. You were away from Daniel for quite a while. I was in a coma. Of course. <laughs> Lady, you look like an organic Etsy you. store. So what is your plan, Sean? This is a blessed family. And you it smell of for beeswax. To have you by his side. You should know that the Lord has big plans for him. Where'd you get that shawl? Older Navy? God or you? God, of course. I'm his family. Two young boys are not a family. Mark 3, 25. Hey, how about uh, Sean, 316? Don't make me pop sand. open a can of ass whooping. It sounds more like a prisoner than a guest. It saddens me that you see things that way. After everything I've done for him. I know why you're scared, Sean. That's because your heart's full of sins. I've heard about what you did in California. How you pushed your brother into felony. This is a terrible sin. And until you make penance for it, I can't accept you here. What? Church is Are for everyone, serious? by the way. I'm sorry, my son. I'm not your son. And Daniel isn't gonna be your golden cow. Daniel, come on. Why don't we ask him what he wants to do? Do not touch me. Oh, she crumpled like a... <laughs> She's got bone-itis. What did you do? Nothing. Enough. She sold it, dude. You spilled blood. She sold it. In the Lord's home. Sean, what happened? It was a dive. My brother came in here impure and acting like a criminal. But he can be saved, Daniel. I'm sorry, Sean. She's right. I will pray for you. Then, when you're ready, we can. She's trying to manipulate Dude, she had a blood pack. Let me lead you to the one true light that never goes out. I want to be your friend. You're crazy. Let's get out of here, Daniel. <clears throat> I want to stay. Just go. There's your answer, Sean. We're together again. New mom so lets me watch know, all the music right? videos I want. Get off me, dude. What? Daniel! <coughs> let me go, asshole! <coughs> Daniel! They're not your family! Stop it. You just need to have faith. We'll be waiting. Daniel! It's okay, Sean. Sean. Daniel! <laughs> <laughs> He's even wearing the backpack like a cool guy. Satisfied. Now don't you ever come back. Dude, just pop off on him. Come on, kid. Don't make me do this. Get up. You're not Get up, Rock. <laughs> he had the, you know I had to do it to him pose. He was the lucky Luciano. You're pissing me off. This is private. What? I have a legal right to stop any intruders like you. I told you, every other encounter Just is bad. One. <laughs> My brother. But he doesn't want you. He was brought here, and this is where he's staying. Next time, I will not hesitate to use this. Get out of here. I keep the thing on me. Daniel, hey! Daniel. Sean. Karen? You won't get him back like this. Well, she's got like the Sims player icon as her necklace. Wait. It's Hotel Hotel Nevada. On a cold desert highway. 
cool wind in my hair. And my mom and the okay, I can't continue with that. I apologize. <laughs> Dude, you call your mom Karen? That's sick. Sean, what happened to your eye? Why the hell are you here? How did you find me? Well, um, I got a letter from uh, Jacob. He said you were missing and that Daniel needed help. I believed him. Hmm. So you finally decided to check on him. You know, Sean, sooner or later, we're going to have to talk. I mean, you ran out on me. I already have a hotel room. You're gonna need to rest and clean that dressing. Yo, they got some serious drainage issues. That kind of plumbing bank up might seem like an inconvenience right now, but that's a, he a headache waiting to happen. You ever see Love It or List It? They always got mold in the foundation, all the pipes aren't up to snuff. Please let me out of this. This terrible scene. <laughs> they didn't quite show me the butt, but they showed me the back dimples. That's that's yellow light. In fact, I would say that's that's the start of the red light. I can see his tramp stamp. Stop with the lines on the abdomen. What are you doing? It's like we're going to pop out. She's yeah. going to be like happy 18th birthday or something. Yo, this is no country for old men. Wonder how long Karen has been here. Did she see one of Daniel's? I know I shouldn't peek, but. Diner bills. What? Karen did her own road trip to get here. Huevos Rancheros. 450? Yo. You gotta take a trip out here. Grilled cheese, eight dollars. Fries, two twenty-five. All right, now you're getting a little expensive. Damn. That said, three dollars, three dollar grilled cheese. That's crazy. Oh my god, no, I'm mom. I'm not reading your poetry. Glad to know she learned the lesson. Yikes. So Karen did check it out. Wonder if she saw Daniel in action. Bibble. <laughs> what does that mean? Use tablet. Huh. This isn't her tablet. <sighs> Yay. Technology. <laughs> she came prepared. Nope. Reverend. Nope. Looks like a roach motel. Two stars! But nice pool, but dusty as fuck. Can we talk about what's going on with Mustard Party 2? <laughs> Stan Una, by the way. Be right back. Pop down for supplies. 
We'll find out. Contact Jacob. You won't last five minutes playing Mustard Party 2. Karen was always into low tech. I even think it's the one she had back then. Okay, where's Jacob's letter? This country is just way too big. It's uh, Americans whenever you talk about America. It's so big. You wouldn't even understand. I don't even have like a passport, dude. Because like there's so many different micro countries inside of America. It's like you could mm. travel without ever America's leaving side. the country and see so many different cultures, dude. Jeez. It only took Supermom eight years to give a shit. If you'll excuse me a moment, I have a delivery. <laughs> One moment, please. I have returned. Seven seven five 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 zero one one eight. Karen was always into low tech. I even think it's the one she had back then. Maybe you could use the phone to call Jacob. Oh, use this phone to call Jacob. You gotta hit zero to dial out, though. Hello? Jacob, it's me, Sean. Sean? No way. I've been waiting to hear from you for months. Yeah. Where are you? You have to come here, Sean. I know. I'm not far. In a motel. Good. Listen, I, I can't talk right now. I gotta go. Wait! Daniel! I'm waiting to hear you from you for months. By the way, I, gotta go. There's a, a, a junction just above Haven Point. There's a, a, a wild mice ranch billboard there. I'll be there at four. Jacob, wait! Yeah, I also don't know what Wild Mice Damn. Ranch is. He couldn't really talk. All this is so messed up. Let's just oh yeah, Sean. Time. 60 <laughs> Wild Mice down at Wild Mice Ranch. Eighteen rat-like mice boys. Hey, sorry it took so long. The fucking store was packed. <laughs> the fucking store fucked us. How you feeling? It's just like a hidden run. <sighs> Nothing broken. Alter boys don't fight fair. Yeah, I'm okay. Double cheese, no onion, right? That'll do. Oh, got her. Got you some gauze and uh, antibacterial stuff for your eye. It's apparently, it's called hey, soul up or something. Or at least take a breath. <sighs> like you care. Sean. She said wolf. I do. <sighs> Come on, Karen. Don't act all hurt. 
It's too late. Where were you when I broke my leg when I was 13? Driving the car! I told you, I'm sorry! When Daniel got a bad flu a couple years ago, he didn't sleep next to him every night. Where were you? Where were you? Fair enough. So let's talk, because we do have to get your brother out of a cult. <laughs> I'm listening. How did you two survive alone? You know, I'm asking the questions. Dad taught me responsibility. He always wanted us to know how to take care of each other. Good. How did you go to Beaver Creek? You know, I don't have to answer your questions, right? You're right. So tell me what you want from me, Sean. Nothing, Karen. I mean, what do you want from me? I kind of want my A fries. Hug. Hey, I just want you to know what I did and why, if you care. So ask me anything. Oh, no. Would you rather fight 50 mouse-sized horses or one horse-sized mouse? All right. Why did you bail on us? I wasn't meant to be a wife or a mother. I thought I was supposed to. I tried to pretend for many years, but I wasn't happy, and the urge to leave just became unbearable. I had no other choice. Um, are you serious? <laughs> I think you, you chose this life. You fell in love. I think love. you had a you choice. You made your own choices, right? Making your own choices doesn't mean you can never fool yourself, Sean. After I had Daniel, you were about eight, and Esteban's garage was getting busy. There was so much going on around me, yet somehow I just felt that my own life was just slipping away. Felt like an empty shell. Yeah, I was just kind of like over it being was the a mom. Decision I ever made. So I just kind of like I removed like myself from the situation. Then, but I took that responsibility. I was just kind of like that mom phase of my life was just sort of so you just over. dumped us so you could be free. Yes, that's exactly what I did. You're just so fucking selfish. So what exactly are you doing in Nevada? You live around here? No, I'm uh, way out in Arizona. Sean, I told you. Your friend uh, Jacob wrote my P.O. box and said Daniel was in trouble. That's it. Arizona? Holy shit. It's just lizards and rocks. <laughs> oh, jeez. Hey, it. now. Phoenix is one of the fastest growing cities in the country. So. Yeah. Okay. I think I've heard enough. I didn't have a choice, Sean. We only have one life, and I didn't want mine to be spent in regrets. Yes, that's why I abandoned my two-year-old. I fooled myself, thinking I'd find satisfaction into what society expected me to be, and that was my mistake. I hope someday you can understand that. Oh, absolutely not. But I never stopped caring about you. Wrong again. For what it's worth, I am sorry for hurting you and Daniel. And so, sorry if you're upset kids oh, I apologize if you, you got offended by my shit. abandonment no matter what you left your own kids and my dad so don't even I know it's too late I just I want you to know how I feel yeah I still don't care jeez Now sing. My baby takes the morning train. He works from nine to five. And then he takes another home again to find me waiting for him. Perfect timing. Sean, whatever you want to say to me, this is the time. Let's just 
get it all out in the open. See what happens. I mean, I get you wanted to leave and stuff, okay, but why would you ghost us like that? Not even a fucking birthday card. I just... I thought if I vanished, you would all move on. Wow, you're dumb. But I wanted to contact you guys so many you times. You are a stupid idiot. <laughs> I almost did. You must be absolutely brain dead. In my defense, I thought about sending you a birthday card. I even almost did it. What do you want from me? But you wanted a clean break from us. I didn't want to be a part-time, pissed-off mother. I wanted to be a full-time asshole. When Daniel was still very young, so he wouldn't remember me. <laughs> you had mission accomplished. Cool plan, Mom. You heard Daniel way worse. He thought you took off because of him. I know. I hope I can make it up to you, Daniel. By someday. doing pretty much nothing. Like start by getting his ass out of that church. Cult. Whatever. So... What did you do when you left? Where did you go? I pursued Dude, this Indiana. reminds me, like, so I watched this uh, documentary on Netflix called Jack of All Trades. And it starts out as, like, a, it's a documentary about baseball cards. Then it eventually it becomes this sh documentary about how, like, the documentarian's dad abandoned him. And he can't, like, open up emotionally to anybody as a result. And at the end of the documentary... He meets and confronts his dad, who he hasn't seen for like 25 years. And he's talking to him and he's like, you know, it's pretty fucked up that you left. And he's like, yeah, I just didn't know what to do. And then it comes out that the dad has like other kids with, with his other women. And he's like, well, do you talk to them? And he's like, nah, I just sort of left them too. And I'm like, dude, what the hell is wrong with you? You abandoned... More than one family? How does that even happen? And failed. Learned the lessons. I guess. Could you just like yeah, find out use some contraception? Which doesn't involve a husband and two kids. It does to a lot of people. And I totally respect that. Just not to me. Yeah, the, good at making then why'd you have a second kid? Of modern life is about, right? School, job, marriage. Ask my mom and dad. They wanted me to follow their rules. What is wrong? You're I like 50. I tried, but I wanted to find my own way with no security blanket. Just get over it. Family, religion. It's all bullshit, norms. Sean. It's just all about security, after all. But it all just looked like a sweet golden. One hundred percent. She has some kind of substance that. dependency. It it starts with religion, jobs. It's all bullshit, Sean. I'm just after the rock. You just sound immature, like a kid running away from home. You're right. I do. But I think people should know who they are. Yeah, maybe before they have two kids! <laughs> Whatever. You sound so... careless. Yep. It's like you can't even realize how much pain you've caused. I do Nailed care. it. That's why I'm here. To help you and your brother. If I didn't step up to help him now, I couldn't live with myself. I gotta change my dressing. This thing fucking hurts. <laughs> Yo, is that Uber Eats? This this is the, the my least favorite character from any piece of media ever. I think it's like it's like Ramsey Bolton, Karen from Life is Strange too. 
Sean, I know I can't change the past. Or what I did. Or even, like, apologize at all brother. for it. You gotta trust me this one time. I, lady, I don't even know you! No, I don't. Not after what you did. But yes. We have to be a team to rescue Daniel. We can do it. I don't want okay. to, but don't nod told me I have to. How? We need to get in touch with this Jacob. He obviously knows a lot more than us about the church. Well, I called him when you were out. We can meet with him tomorrow. Okay, good. I also got these, just in case. It's a baby monitor? After your history? Okay. Better take care of the eye. So... You feel like telling me the story here? Not really. Gotcha. Here, try this on. Well, that makes up for 14 years of no mom. She got me a medical eye patch. Don't say I never did nothing for you, kid. How do I look? Great. Thanks. It's Sagat. That's the joke. Except he's not like nine feet tall. This is the most rusted vehicle I think I've ever seen in my entire life. It's like the She's rust is actually up. airbrushed onto the truck. He better. He promised. Well, if he doesn't find It's like us, she can't just have a shitty we'll truck, him. right? He's the, her open scene. Karen's truck is absolutely it's fucked. Good. It looks like a decroated piece of shit. In order to symbolize how messed up her fucking life is. I cannot possibly describe... Just make the texture one big piece of rust, if possible, with some blue specks. Sweet encounters. Hope I can see them again someday. Oh, you will. So tell me about Daniel. What's he like? Nope. You, you lost that luxury. Well, he's definitely... Special. Hope so. He's your brother, right? Heads up. Is that him? Steve Ho's yeah. Wild here. Mice Ranch. Sean! Uh -oh. What happened? That <laughs> shirt. <Sure>. Did you. <laughs> Chad walk versus the, the virgin Jacob. Jake, I'm not mad, but you better explain everything. I didn't know where else to go. Listen, I, I saw Daniel come back to the camp that night. Like he was in shock or something. Then I heard all these sirens and I got scared. I just, I packed a few things. I, I took a blanket from your tent and we, we left together. Chad, this is Jacob. I also kept the cash you made on the farm. Uh, it's in my car. You did right, Jake. Thank you. You have no idea what he looked like when I found him that night, Sean. He was in bad shape, with a gunshot wound, and all by himself. I, 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 I couldn't just leave him there. What about the others? Hannah, Cassidy, Penny... What Anders? To them. They 
ran over to Meryl's place when they found out Finn was gone. That was the last time I saw them. Then on our way out here, Daniel told me more about what happened that night. How scared he was. The blast. Daniel feels he's got to redeem himself for what he did. I need to get to him, Jacob. I'm the asshole who went along with the robbery. I'm telling you to be careful with the Reverend Mother. She's waited her whole life for somebody like Daniel. The Reverend knows how to manipulate people. She's good at this. He wants to stay with her. Daniel has faith in the Reverend now. Yeah, not afraid of that Lisbeth of yours. I'm getting Daniel out of here. Uh, come on. Oh, no. Hey, boys, uh, no just saw you guys talking, and it reminded me that I'm going to fuck off and We're leave you here. Ask for that permission. You must be See you me. later. I'm Karen. Hi. Okay. I don't know if you want to do this, but I, I have an idea. I think school must be over by now, but Lisbeth will stay at the church with Daniel for his special classes. That'll give us time to sneak into the compound before we get to them. I'll be on the lookout. Keep watch in case it all goes to shit. Or if Sean's I need to bounce. Milwaukee. Sounds like a plan. One more thing. I, uh, we have to get my sister too. Sarah Lee. <laughs> really, Jacob? Come on, man. She's with your parents. I know. Please, listen, Sean. <sighs> She's not safe here. She's sick. They believe in everything Lisbeth says. And she says she'll cure Sarah with prayers. Oh no. They're anti-vaxxers. I know you understand. Right? Damn, Jake. We need his help too, Sean. Okay, Jake. Shut up, Mom! I'm listening. Lisbeth knows what's wrong with Sarah Lee. We just, we need to find her medical record. I think it's in her home office. Then I'll go get Sarah Lee while you get Daniel. Okay? Fine. Sure. I'm gonna trust you on this, Jacob. All good for you, Karen. What Just kidding. I do not him? care. He will. I know him. It's like a new truck that came pre-rusted. Take Russ to drive up the sympathy. It just doesn't make sense, okay? Here's my prediction. We're going to think that our mom abandoned us halfway through this heist, but then she's going to come back out of nowhere as a deus ex mamina, and she's going to make it all happen, maybe sacrifice herself, and I am 100% still not going to forgive her. Because what she's done is not necessarily completely unforgivable, but unforgivable due to the actions of a single day or two. Of course. You you got to have uh, decades minimum of goodwill built up to, to even start to counteract that. Okay. And you sure Lisbeth will have those files on your sister? Watch out, Sean. There are people right outside. Oh, shit. How many? Yep. Got it. Thanks. People aren't supposed to come and go around the church once the service is over. Better to avoid them if we can. Okay. Call Karen with your walkie-talkie. Karen. Everything all right? Yeah, don't worry about me. It's three states away from you, your brother, and your father. Be careful, though. You never know. Thanks, Sean. I will.
It's all bullshit, Sean. Work, religion, responsibility, laundry, fuck that, dude. Bills, so, electricity, did you grow up out of here? Debt to no. society, I mean, felonies and misdemeanors, I mean, Sean. It's all when Elizabeth came it's out. It's all fucked, dude. Point, my Mopping her and brought me along. Hmm. Must have been hard. Did I say responsibility? Kinda. Eight-year-olds don't want to go to church all day. Okay. There it is. Looks empty. <sighs> Let's hope so. What, you got x-ray vision us, now? We never close our door. Closed door is a closed heart, she says. Personally, I want my heart to be closed so that none of the blood leaks out while it's pumping. Can't believe Daniel really lives in this depressing house. <sighs> We did it. You know what's really depressing? Yeah, we have a little bit more this would time. probably be like yes, we do. two point two million dollars nice in Vancouver. Work. So where are the files? Right there in her office. Oh, of course it's locked. A locked door, door is like a lock heart. Lie. We gotta find a way in. Fuck. <laughs> Think there's a key somewhere? Maybe she's too cautious not to have a spare set around. Uh the old uh find the key in the house trick. All righty. Look behind the painting. Damn. This is so artless. Are you okay, Jake? Yeah. Make me feel so yeah. artless. It's just so full of memories and stuff. Daniel's haircut makes much more sense now. <laughs> this is a lot of pills. You get it? Because it's like, it Especially seems like everything's so good on the outside, but on the inside, it's actually fucked, dude. It's like they put out this image of having, like, the ideal life. But, like, in reality, they got problems just like everybody else, dude. Whoa. This place Whoa. is worse than army camp. That's crazy. Take out the trash on Monday? Wash your hair once every two days? What is this, prison? Coaxing lesson one. Get Daniel his favorite cereal. The moat and the bean. Antibiotics for yeast infection. Get me out of here. Run, Sean, run. There's spores in the air, dude. I didn't need to know. Don't see anything of interest. You no comment about that one? About how, like, you know, you're, like, Whoa. the same because you both smoke, even though church. she's trying to seem so pious? Now they're thirsty. Oh, shit. Looks like the Reverend Mother got to this letter before Jake. Those were playing cards. Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> My mistake. Man, that that looks like a good book. Okay. What the? She's completely obsessed with his power. Miracles for dummies. Hey. I found your letter for Jacob. Too bad Lisbeth found it first. Religious icon. <sighs> Nothing here. <laughs> what does it look like a like a super punch out player photo? Does she even believe in any of this? Jesus Christ. <laughs> Yeah. Man. It's depressing. 
It's not well, that depressing. Elizabeth doesn't believe in material possessions, so. Doesn't mean you need to decorate your house like a prison. It's not that bad, dude. Sean, is everything all right in there? No matter what happened, I guess Finn was a real friend to Daniel. Yes. We're trying to get into her office. She's locked. <laughs> yes. We're trying to get into her office. She's locked it up, so... What is this? <sighs> yes. We're trying to get into her office. <sighs> Shit. People are really all over his power. <sighs> yes. <laughs> We're trying to get into her office. I love She's it. She's locked it up, so... Is she forcing him to do this? <sighs> yes. We're trying to get into her office. She's locked it up. <sighs> locked, of course. They just gave up. <laughs> they gave up. That's fair. She's probably just holding the talk button down now. Mm. <sighs> Nothing interesting. Well, I guess we just gotta beat the door down. Mm. Might be enough to open that door. Uh, Sean, hey, you, you think that's a good idea? Yes. Hell yeah. Oh, perfect. Whoa. Is this her personal archive or something? Yeah. She keeps track of everything in here. This is like Stuff the worst part in this one. of Tarkov. Okay, I've got something. Must be what you're looking for. Damn. She has pneumonia? And for what I get, Lisbeth knows damn well she needs medical She's got treatment. an atomic That's yeast criminal. infection, too. She's insane. This whole house is She's crawling with contagious yeast. You can take a peek and see how she really treats her flock. Man, what's all this? Were you like sick? Conversion therapy? Did they? I get it. Wanted to cure you from being <laughs> pretty much. I always showed more interest in boys than girls. <laughs> they thought I was a freak. A sinner. Didn't you... tell your parents? <laughs> you kidding? They wanted her to do that. Mom and Dad thought I had a demon inside. So did I. I really did believe I was a sinner. So I thought I had to atone for my sins. And, uh, how did that go? Not good. I Not well. I just prayed all the time and stopped hanging out with boys, girls, everybody. I started depressed. going online a lot. Paranoid. Image boards. Damn, Jake. After a few years... I was in a really bad place. I I tried to hurt myself. Elizabeth was very upset. We had a long chat. She told me I should leave. Go see the world and figure things out. Homegrown I, Simpson I don't stuff. I really get her, Sean. But Elizabeth does believe in all of this stuff. I had no clue about your life here. I'm... I'm sorry, Jake. I'm sorry I brought Daniel here. I was just so blown away when I saw what he could do. It was like a real miracle. I, I thought I'd, I'd found my faith again. Instead, I, I just heard him. Then let's make things right. We just have to get Daniel out of here. 
I hope so. And I'll get my sister to a hospital. Have you a gotta treat. get a longer shirt, too. I it's not the time, but it, it cuts off right at the belt line. It's gotta go, like, an inch further than that. It's like you're wearing a, a, a crop top that's too big. It's very strange. Yeah. Anything would be better than here. Right. I just hope they can still cure her. Sean, are you there? <sighs> What's up? You got company. That thug who works for Elizabeth. <laughs> that <holding> thug. <laughs> this guy is dangerous, Sean. Hey, Trust me. I have a good plan to get him out of your way. He'll give you more time. All right, I'm going to abandon you and your brother for a decade. Yeah. See what you can do. I will. Get ready. Sean, we gotta hide. Now. Now I'm looking at the closet. Camera pointed at the closet. Hurry up. The Jacob in the cupboard. Oh. Come on, Sean. We need to hide. Hold up. Freak, close the cabinet, dude. Man, if he finds us here, we're screwed. It's two on the nose, Jacob. We can't go in there. We gotta go in here. Oh, shit. Jacob, I'm sorry. We'll talk about the irony of this situation later. <laughs> He's just standing. He's gonna do the old behind the door trick. Oh, <laughs> The perfect Hello? crime. Someone there? This is deadly premonition. Huh? What? What the fuck is going on? I see you. Sean, do you think it's got to be Karen? Oh, he's gone. Let's get out of here. Oh, man, that was crazy. I really thought he was going to catch us. The guy's leaving. It did sound like she <laughs> ran someone over. Look at that. Your mom is hardcore. What? Yeah, I guess she is. So we're all good now? I'll go get Sarah Lee while you get Daniel. Then let's meet up at the car, okay? All right. Yo, our mom be careful, is okay? fucked. You too, Sean. <laughs> Jeez. This is some, like, Icelandic saga stuff. Come in, Karen. See anything? No, you're all clear. Awesome. Talk later. <laughs> Sorry, what's my objective again? Enter the church. Always take the back door. Locked. They love locking doors here, dude. Unlike in Canada, where Michael Moore would have you believe that nobody locks their doors. Don't so you know what you're gonna do? No, but let's do it. Oh, Lord, let your power speak through this young vessel. I am your humble Sean. servant and will obey what the hell your is this? every command. Speak to me. It's Daniel. Speak. I told you, he's kind of special. Hey, Sean, you came back? And I know. 
Little cub. Come with me, Daniel. We're leaving. What? No. I'm not going anywhere. She's full of shit, dude. And she's using you. Daniel has made his choice, Sean. But I'm offering you to join us again. Put your faith in me. And you'll be family. Never. So that's your final decision. May the Lord have mercy on your lost soul. It's time for you to leave our sanctuary right now. Not without my brother. I'm not going anywhere. This is my home. She's my family now. Daniel, listen. She's not your family. Who are you again? Who is she? Our mother. Uh. She came here for you. Oh, praise the Lord. Another miracle at our church. Wonderful. Uh, it's all right, Daniel. Go see her. I mean, she's right there. Don't be afraid. I... Uh, I don't know her. Of course. I know. This is hard for you, Fair. my son. Stop calling him that. You're just manipulating him, you sicko. <laughs> That's in the eye of the beholder. But since you are his mother, let me ask you. Uh-oh. How could you let your child wander alone in the wilderness yeah like i know Where lady but two wrongs daniel doesn't make a son. right Where? listen daniel i came here as soon as i found out you were here on your own i'm not on my own children are a gift from the lord they are a reward from him you were blessed if you watch some of the reality gift. tv that i watch you might and rethink you that cast position. him out into the world. Who the hell are you? You might have been his mother once, but when you abandoned him, you also gave up your rights. Yeah, like because she's right, but also she's wrong in like a different you way. No idea You're both terrible for different sense. reasons. How can you pretend to care about these two children? You left them and your husband. To seek out your base desires. Yeah, we know she's garbage, but that doesn't mean you're in the clear. Think by yourself. You're smarter than this. Daniel, she's responsible for what happened to No, that that part's not true. It was an accident. That's what this she's, world is about. She saw the accident. sale and she got Injustice. desperate. She started Pain. to oversell. I'm just so sorry, Daniel. I know. I know how much I hurt you and your brother by leaving. I'm still coming to terms with how much of it is my fault. I hope we can talk about this together. In a few years. That's what I've been trying to tell your brother. And I'm so glad he listened. You gotta trust us. Did I? She's using you for her selfish desires. Daniel, this time the choice is yours. Are you going to believe her or me? I, uh, I. That's right. You can't tempt Daniel from this garden. Giant He'll douche stay versus with us, turd sandwich. His true family, and we'll never leave him. Go to hell! Come on, Daniel. No. no! Reverend, are you okay? Nicholas, they're, they're heretics sent to desecrate our, our church. Okay, what now? Don't you understand? This is over, Sean. You have to talk to him. You can convince him, Sean. I won't leave you, Daniel. Not here. Don't be so stubborn, Sean. Your brother chose his path. Your friend, Sarah Lee? She's very sick. And Lisbeth won't take her to a doctor. What? Or even to the she pharmacy to, to get some monistat. Daniel knows who to trust. Don't listen to her religious bullshit. You need to have faith in yourself. Not in her. But you said heaven and God existed. Why are you lying? 
You're right. <laughs> He's wicked, unfaithful. <laughs> I don't know about this one. Let's go why. She was kicked out of her previous church. Yeah. They knew she was crazy. So she left and founded Haven Point. Why would they do that? Did she do something wrong? Liar. I left on my own because they were all blind. Don't believe his lies, Daniel. I found a letter from Karen, her mother, inside We got through two house. of her health bars. She hid it from you. So you never know. She's looking for you. What? You told me she didn't want to see me. See what you have done. Hey, Inano. Back off. No one. Now nah, we're going to see some torso you. explosions. I said, stop. <sighs> This character exists exclusively to have his torso blown up. I came all this way for you, and nobody will stop me. I'll even cross hell or whatever if I need. <sighs> Sean! This kid, kid really knows how to take a punch. Listen, I know I wasn't a great brother, I was an asshole. I should have never agreed to do that heist. It was stupid. Sure, Yo, save the flat screen, he dude. Left you just like that harlot did. Shut him yeah, up. we know he mom sucks. Wants. I won't give Get up. Get over it. Don't, hate him. <sighs> Don't let them do that, Daniel. <sighs> if I could go back in time. I would. We'd be in our living room in Seattle. That would get us pizza and snacks, then pick the movie because we would always fight about it. Watch The Irishman again. He always picked your movie. But I can't do that. All I can do now is fight. Quiet! What are you waiting for? We're the best team in Anu. Stop so it! We have to keep going no. forward. What are you going to kill him? Please! He's my brother! You can burn down our church, but not our faith. Daniel knows you're telling the <laughs> truth. Do it, he's a world star. Don't give up. I think when you get knocked out, but Nothing. your hands stay up in a guard. It's going to stop me, Daniel. It's a sign that something's seriously wrong. Dad always said. Our blood link was the most important thing. You know that. Please! Stop! Leave him alone! Daniel, listen to him! Mom's like, geez, I think I left the stove on back at the hotel room. I'll be back in a second. No matter what she does, I'll come right back again and again. I love you, Daniel. I do too. She shut him up now. Don't move. Just stop. If you want to kill me, then do it. I'm not afraid. Do it. Toy <laughs> day. Hey. Yo, this is uh don't shoot me in the face. Is that classic biblical parable? No. Just cut the brother in half, so you each get half of it. Stop! Daniel! Sean! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was so confused. I thought she was someone else. I'm sorry. Sean, we need to get out of here. Yeah, now. maybe like four minutes ago. That <laughs> that ember. Oh, no. 
Just fell on no. our ten-year-old brother. You started this fire. You will all burn in this hell. Move. Let us go. Move it. You won't leave this place. Not with me alive. Dude, shoot her in the kneecap. I said move. Or I will hurt you. Sean. Foolish child. You can't threaten me with death. I embrace it. I know what awaits me. I... It doesn't say kill. Sorry. It just says get rid of. Honestly, dude, I have no remorse. I am just... I've had it up to here with the southwestern United States. It was fucking with Sean. It's time for the revenge fantasy. I mean, I hate to take the literalist approach, but if you're in a burning building and someone's like, hey, I'm not letting you leave, I think you got a case. You at least have a defense. I'm not saying you'd get off, but you'd at least be able to mount, you know, a, a valiant sort of uh, argument. I like the idea that it's actually like badass music. And now you'd be to shave while you kill yourself. And I got just the thing for you to offer. Go on and save yourself. Take it on me. Vaporize him, Daniel. <laughs> I know there's music. Yes, yeah, so this episode also kind of sucked really badly. Like maybe maybe the worst of all of them so far. No, there is one more episode. I, I sort of agree that, like, I actually think it's less subtle than Detroit. And I, I don't say that with carelessness. I think there is a chance that Detroit might be more subtle. And Detroit is, I mean, obviously extraordinarily over the top. I will say, in Detroit, they do have the robot ride on the back of the bus. But I feel like if Don't Nod had ridden that, they would have said, Get to the back of the bus, robot! I just didn't even want to point out 
that one of the people in the game, one of the characters, was named Chad Michelson, and his actor was Michael Gash. It's just... It's not even, like, fair to bring up, but, like... It is kind of comical. <laughs> I'm I'm not sure about about Life is Strange too, dude. I guess you're just along for the ride at this point. No, I don't want to read reviews of this episode necessarily because I think like if. You play this game, and it has, like, an emotional impact or resonance for you. I don't want to, like, you know, admonish that. I think that that's cool. But I'm just so, like, irony poisoned that unless something really nails, like, those emotional beats, it comes across as, like, artificial and, you know, saccharine. Okay, I, I gotta see some of these. You didn't talk to Finn, 41%. I am surprised there are other sensible individuals here. 34% of people yeeted the guard. 74% of people sold out Finn. <laughs> you sang the song. 89% of people got into the into the truck. You were 2% of people were hard on Karen during the conversation. Are you insane? Overall, you tried to let Karen open up to you. 2%? You didn't say outside with Karen. 8% actually insane you shot Lisbeth while Daniel wasn't hurting her 4% <laughs> oops let's see it's just me and cry I think we both passed the test he sold out Finn did not attack the guard also didn't talk to Finn, uh, man of taste. We both sang, both got in the truck. Tried to let Karen open up to you. Not a surprise, I was in the minority there. You spared her life. No more stats on this one, huh? Oh, episode five, we're at the freaking amusement park, and oh shit, Daniel's psychic powers got us into trouble again. Hey, Daniel. What do we do now? Dude, if I Make am waiting calls. for nuance when the series has finally gotten you to ready? the US Mexico border, yeah. I think I'm I think. looking for love in all the wrong places. <laughs> Yikes. You, what do you think the odds are that it, the game ends with Daniel exploding the wall with his mind? I don't know if you should play the next one. <laughs> let me let me out of Life is Strange too, please. You're still playing music, but I closed you. Okay, Steam. Life is Strange 2, Episode 4. It does have bad reviews, mostly negative reviews on Steam. Wish I could have left Daniel behind or kill him myself. Way too annoying, frustrating, and all-around shit episode. I wanted to leave Daniel here because he's not worth my time. Thank God this is a game based around choices because abandoning your brother is not something you're allowed to do in the game. Turns out the only inter interesting mystery in the game was, in fact, not interesting. Easily the worst episode. Tedious with nothing exciting until the last 10 minutes. Till now, I had no problem with Daniel. 
This episode made him way too annoying. No content, so boring. Terrible. Total waste of blanking time. You don't miss anything if you don't play this trash called episode 4. Let's see positive reviews. Don't listen to negative reviews. This episode really fell short. Positive review, by the way. Amazing episode. Very touching moments. Many people will provide negative reviews because it criticizes Christian evangelical extremism. Ignore them and see for yourself. Very much desert. By far the best episode. I loved it a lot, especially the ending. It was just purely amazing. Boring and very dumb. Terrible. Shortest episode I feel ripped off. Worst episode of any game I've ever played in this genre. Complete snore bore. Let me see. Uh, let me see reviews of the episodes here. Life is strange too. Life is Strange 2, Episode 2. Reviews, mostly positive, 73%. You know, I kind of agree with that. Episode 3, positive, 83%. Y'all are crazy. Life is Strange, Episode 4. No, we already did that one. Episode 1. That's, that's Life is Strange 1, Episode 1. Life is Strange... Two, 86%. I think that's fair as well. Let's see. Life is Strange 5. Episode 5 has mostly positive reviews. So it seems like kind of a return to, to whatever the form is for the rest of the, the game. <laughs> so... I mean, I gotta be real with you. Four was four was not very good, but I am excited to finish it and to see it off. I actually felt like I don't know. Maybe my favorite episode is one or two for sure so far. One was a little bit overwrought. Two was a largely boring, but kind of okay. Life is Strange 1 was like, man, it's so much better than this. Life is Strange 1. Let me see. Life is Strange, episode 1. Overwhelmingly positive. 96% of, these, of the 130,000 reviews are positive. I, I mean, I agree. I, do I agree 96%? No, that's not my job. I just agree that I give it a thumbs up. Anyway, I don't know. We could, we could probably fit in like a game or two of Tetris to finish the stream off today. If Forza didn't take 20 minutes to load, we might go in that direction, but... Hades is like 45 minutes per run. I'm not going to do a Hades run right now. No, I'm not going to do a poll. Democracy is actually fucked. All we need is one guy at the top making the right decisions like me.
Invictus, please. There will probably be Forza on the stream tomorrow, is my guess. And Halo? I don't know. I don't know, we'll see. We're definitely playing Halo on Wednesdays, so... But there won't be a stream on Wednesday because it's Christmas. Twenty-eight people in Invictus. Okay! Two players with a little T-space in the middle? Yo, start me up. I'm ready. So I haven't played Tetris since last Tuesday, when Daniel and I played some squads. So I apologize. Might be a little bit rusted at the start of this. I'm feeling rusted already, I'll tell you that much. Okay, rust is off. Did not take that long. Didn't mean for that to go there. Okay, just send it. When are we seeing those squads? Good news for you. The first one should be up on YouTube. As of, like, right now. You can go out and get it. At game retailers. Right now. You know what? Just flex on him, dude. That's a very bad use of a, of a T-spin, but it's also just kind of funny. Ooh. I don't know about that one. Okay, you gotta, you gotta get yourself out of a jam. Something like that. You can make mistakes in Tetris. I mean, I don't know, I've probably said this 500 times now. If you play fast, everything just falls into place. At least in the early game. I firmly believe you can be like, pretty much garbage at Tetris, and still do okay in Invictus. Because Invictus... ...is not actually hard. How's that for a Galaxy Brain opinion? No, that wasn't meant to go there! You ruined my T-spin, dude! What are you doing? Alright, this one... I'll level with you. A little bit of Swiss cheese. That's okay. You get the attackers. Then you get ready to yeet the attackers. Like so. Better. No, 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 you do that one, that one, this one, and you go back to KOs, we're saved. Don't you dare hit me with a resident sleeper on Tetris. Didn't you read the Our Northern Lion thread? Is 2019's uh, series of the year? YouTube edition. Twitch edition obviously goes to uh, Deadly Premonition. It's like you're not even following the discourse. You're okay. You're okay. You're okay. Still okay. Misplaced a piece for certain, but still okay. Big sense. Fahrenheit? Was that this year? Man, that's crazy. It's been a long year. In a good way. I talked about it in an Isaac episode, I don't know if it's gone up yet. This has been like the longest year of my life, but like... 
in a way that's weirdly positive. It's like when I think back to this year, I'm like, this year was like a hundred years long for me. But I enjoyed most of it. Okay, we, we got a real uh, piece of trash after us right now. He's trying to win the game like some kind of evil person. I don't support it. You know what? You gotta do what you gotta do sometimes. Random! There you go. We're free. Wrong move. Sorry, this is, we're getting... We're closing in on real radio silence moments. There we go. There we don't go. Let me out. Let me out. I don't want to go back to randoms. I'm going to randoms. Had to be done, I think. Oh, we're back. Oh, we're back. That's one heck of an attacker, though. There's a there's a sincere badge lord up there. Good timing, maybe. Good, good. Many attackers. That's not a bad thing. That was not smart. Not a not a huge problem though. I don't mind. I don't mind. More attackers, please. Okay. Still okay. Still okay. Still okay. Bad again. No, 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 no. Really bad. And saved. They wouldn't let me get it out. They wouldn't let me get it out, dude. Oh. Ah. We were close. We were close. Give me one more. One bad pink piece cost us that game. Any plans to see cats? Uh... No. When it, when it comes out on a streaming service, I might watch it. Because it seems hilarious. Like, I, I, did you see on Twitter there was a... A scene where Judy Dench just has human hands? Like, that's the... It does appeal to me. Like, an, an incredibly ambitious 
major studio failure. But I don't want to pay money to see it in theaters. Also, I feel like the kind of people that would see it in theaters would make me hate being at the theater because they probably sing along to the songs. I can't believe they're going to patch it. I did, of course, see the news about the patch, but I was like, bro, the word is out. It's like patching up a sunken ship. Like you're going to you're going to redistribute the movie to theaters and then uh it's going to make like 20% in its second weekend what it made in its first weekend. It's Zoomer marketing? I don't think so. I don't I don't believe so. The percentage of people who will pay to watch something like that as a joke is like, it's gotta be low. I know because, you know, I've been in that demographic. That won't work. It might have worked. Doesn't have to work though. Honestly, it feels good to be back, playing some Tetris, making some waves, getting some KOs. It was the right time for the series to go. But I don't want to lose my skills, you know? I still want to... Still want to keep... I don't want to be playing as much Tetris 99 as I used to. But I do want to be able to pop off like a casual Tetris match at any possible time and still feel like I got a chance to win. And I think we're there, like... I think we're there. But no, it, it will not be coming back in any kind of long-form context. It had enough time. I mean, if you had told me at the start of 2019, we would have like a multiple hundred episode series of Tetris, I would have been surprised. I, I probably wouldn't have believed you. But I don't know. I might be like, well, I don't want to believe you, but I've done some wacky stuff before, so maybe. Very solid bail, though. That's okay. As far as misdrops go, that's like... That's pretty reasonable. That one sucked, though. There you go. Okay, that's the Chris Moneymaker right there. That, to me, that looks like a T-spin. Whether or not it's actually a T-spin, I do not know. And not know, but... Hold on, I can feel the slowness starting to creep in. No slowness, please, only speed. No slowness, only speed. There's a lot of attackers, and that's what you like to see at this stage of the game. As long as you're in a comfortable position. Bad placement. Ruined our two tile. It's alright. Send him. Little send. Just a little baby send. Look at these little baby sends right there. Okay. Still a lot of attackers. You love to see it. Some people would tell you they hate to see it. Those people, there's a special name for them. Cowards. Their names will not be re remembered. 
in the halls of Valhalla. Get over? If you won't get over, you gotta get under. Okay, I didn't mean that to come across as like a threatening uh, pseudo-sexual statement. I apologize. Sometimes you say things in Tetris like, you know, get that hole open. You think it's okay, then you think about it for a second and you go, mm, it came out kind of weird. Saved. Saved. Is, oh my god, is NL going for a T-spin? <laughs> At this stage of the game? Oh yes. Oh yes. <laughs> okay, radio silence? That's pretty bad. We gotta bail. Yikes, uh, okay. Can you just like rotate out of there? It won't go, dude! Oh, that's not right. Just let it. Please. Just wanna, just wanna taste sunlight again. Why? He's somehow done it. We were, we were drowning in quicksand for like that whole game. Still got it done though. Frosh, what happened? <laughs> Don't be mad at Frosh, okay? He's only level 99. I'm level one prestige. How many wins is that? That is 19 Tetris 99 Invictus wins. Not too bad, you know, we had a we had a, a first and a second. Let me go see what Kate's up to.
King of Hemp Trees is going to play Soko Loco Deluxe. It is a uh, train minimalist city slash town building puzzle game that also got recommended to me on Steam Labs earlier this week. Go check it out. I'm going to send you over there. Thanks for watching. I will see you tomorrow for the Northern Lion Live Super Show. Twitch.tv slash Northern Lion. Featuring J. Smith OTI, Michael A. L. Fox, hopefully. Either way, we will uh, see you next time. See ya!